everybody. Welcome back to Renewed Homestead. I'm Ben, and Denise and I came over to Perma Pastures Farm, and you know we came over to help process a couple of pigs, and we we got a raw deal out of this. I mean, we got a really raw deal, a lot of raw meat. I mean, we got they did us dirty in the best possible ben, way. I'm <laughs> so sorry, man. I promise I'll try never to let it happen again. I'm so oh, sorry no, that you know. No, no, no! Don't apologize. <laughs> no, I'm, I really am. I'm, I'm, look, I want to make a public apology to everybody out there, um, especially the people like uh, Yuval Noel Harari and Klaus Schwab out there. I promise I will never produce so much abundance that we got to give it away. I, it's never going to happen again. I promise you. Well, that's uh, that, that's 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 a burden we're willing to take on for you. Yeah, yeah. I, I do appreciate y'all being able to, you know share the burden you guys are such wonderful friends and i'm so sorry to do you as dirty as i did i mean you know I'm, i mean that's really a heavy burden to ask somebody to take 300 pounds of meat and take it home and put it in the freezer man i'm so sorry for that well you know i, I appreciate the apology you know we for a long time we really we really thought of you guys as friends but you know what you know your family oh your well family. thank you brother I'm sorry. Actually, I gotta confess, it wasn't 300. It's more like 200 pounds. Well, you know, I'm, I'm sorry. I mean, I'm, I'm so sorry that you know all of us within these communities are going out of our way to help each other. Like every time we need anything, and the bat signal goes up, yeah. Ben and Denise are on the first thing smoking, and it sucks because Michelle feels compelled to make the favorite things I love to eat, like <laughs> lasagna. Swedish meatballs, cinnamon rolls. Cinnamon rolls, the be world's best cinnamon rolls. It's it, it's just a mess, man. It, I'm really, you know, I go to bed at night reflecting on these things, and it's like, I got nothing done out of that day. I just, you know, I'm, I'm worked to death. I'm tired. I feel like I didn't accomplish anything. I know it sucks, man. My waistline grew another two inches yesterday alone. Uh, yeah. And mine too. Um, mm. you know, dude, yeah, this I sucks. Got the extra, next, well, so you're able to at least tuck yours in, dude. I still got to. <laughs> Pretend that I'm buttoning this thing together right now, you know? <laughs> <laughs> All right. Well, you all, you know we're joking. We love these guys. We had a great couple of days processing pigs, helping them out, just the, the companionship. Huh? Helping us out. Oh, well, obviously helping us out always. They always, you know, we can never... We can never repay your kindness to us, but... No, that's you know. a, no it's a double-edged sword, and that's the beauty about community, is that, you know, it was just a couple of years ago, we barely knew each other. We didn't know each other. You came over for a chicken we, process. We met right here. Yeah, right here, practically at this table that looks like the LaBianca murders just happened on it, but yep. that's okay. I mean, <laughs> it's... Um, but no, that's the cool thing is that you kind of have this dating period, so to speak, when you meet new people and then you find out, do we have this in common? Do we have this in common? Yep. And then we help each other. And honestly, for those that are out there that are thinking about this, you want the quickest way to build a bond with people? Do difficult tasks yep. together. Because it sucks dragging a pig, and you've done this, what, four times now? Yep. Drug them way out of the top of these mountains, all the way down here. It sucks, it hurts. It stinks. But this is but this is how you build this is how you do it in the army. Like when you're in when you share hard training together, when you share hard tasks together, it binds you closer. So that's why as many times as we can, when we got tough jobs, we get over there, we all bust it out, and whoever's hosting it usually feeds everybody. Yep. And so and then by the way, this guy makes burgers. I swear. They are so perfectly round that you swear he put them in a press. But he must what do you spend like 20 minutes making these oh, things by hand? Oh, at least, at least. I'm just really good at working my meat. <laughs> I've been known. <laughs> well, from one meat smith to another. Well, we, we thank you, and, and we can't wait to do it again. All right, thanks, everybody. Appreciate you. Uh, make sure you check us out at RenewedHomestead.com. you find this on uh, Patreon as well. And no, of no, course, you'll find Billy on Patreon. No, no, that's right. We'll find Billy on Patreon. You'll find us on uh, on. Uh, Rumble. Rumble, that's the other one. Yeah, but, yeah. But yeah, we got the cool shirts too. Large and proud. Yeah, there All you right. go. All Good right. thing these things are stretchy, bro. That's right. For me. Yeah. <laughs> Take care, everybody. God bless. See you on the next video. Bye.